Plans will officially move forward to build a new public safety training facility for the city of Atlanta. The Atlanta City Council voted in favor of leasing land for the project to the Atlanta Police Foundation to build that training center. The project itself has been at the center of protests. At a news conference today, Atlanta Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms and the city's fire and police chief spoke about the project. Well, Fox Size Brooke Zahner joins us now live with the details. Brooke. Yeah, Russ and Courtney, critics of this project, they've spoken out about this. They've protested for weeks now, hoping that it would not come to this point. And Mayor Bottom says she understands that people are frustrated, but she says it was ultimately the right decision for this project to move forward. Ten yay. Four nays. In a 10 to 4 vote, the Atlanta City Council votes in favor of leasing 350 acres of land in DeKalb County to the Atlanta Police Foundation. The move means plans to build this new public safety training campus for the city of Atlanta can now move forward. And I know that everybody is not going to be pleased. There are many people who are unhappy about it. On Thursday, Atlanta Mayor Keisha Lance Bottom stood alongside Atlanta's police and fire chiefs who all voiced their support for the project. Atlanta Police Chief Rodney Bryant says the current training facilities for police and fire personnel are barely usable and an upgrade is necessary. For years, and I mean years, decades, have trained in substandard conditions. This will allow us to move forward not just for the policing of today. The $90 million project will be built on this piece of land in DeKalb County. The site will take up 85 acres of that property, leaving 265 acres left for green space. Some people opposed to the project wanted to see all of that land preserved. We looked at several properties. I even put up several properties for consideration, but they were just not the appropriate fit. At a protest last month, dozens of critics said the money should be spent on resources for the community instead of policing. We don't believe that better trained police officers is what the solution is to any of this. We in fact believe that if that funding does exist, uh, it should go into community support and actually meeting the needs of community. Now, Mayor Bottoms also criticized those who say that less money should go to policing. She says that this training facility will be as much of a benefit for the community as it will for those law enforcement officers who will use it. Reporting live in front of APD headquarters, I'm Brooks Honor, Fox 5 News. All right, the debate goes on. Brooke, thanks.